Wow, I can't believe the first week of school is already over. Time really flies. First week? I can't believe it's senior year and it's already so stressful. My college applications, all my AP classes, and I decided to tutor kids. And now for some reason, Strawberry hates us. She's been avoiding me all week. Have you spoken to her at all? I barely have time to talk to anyone. This is our first lunch together all week. Can you believe that? I know what you mean. I'm so stressed. I've never been this busy in my life. I usually have three Big Macs at lunch and well, now I only have two. Why are you so stressed? You said you don't want to concern yourself with school because you want to focus on your music. And music isn't stressful. And seeing my bestie single isn't stressful. Hello, Rhea. There's more to life than being in a relationship, Tootsie. You're right. There's also parties in which boys are present and you can meet them and then get into a relationship, which is exactly why we're going to Sidman's pool party tonight. I can't. I have so much work to do. What work? It's only the first week of school. Besides, I already told Cam, my boyfriend, <laughs> that we're going. Yes. Oopsie. Never could have been thinking I would know what the future brings. We need a little privacy if you can't tell. Do you think they're not letting her sit with them because she's pregnant? That's so rude. Did you see Becky during rehearsals? I couldn't even believe- Immediately no. Immediately no. Where was I? I feel so bad for her. You know, my mom was pregnant with me in her senior year. Is this what she had to go through? Probably. Tell her to come sit with us. You hoo Yeah, you come sit with us. <laughs> Hi. Thank you so much for letting me sit here with you. But my name is actually Mary, not you hoo Nice to meet you. I'm Tootsie, and this is my best friend Rhea, who's sadly still a virgin. Tootsie! <sighs> That's wonderful. Saving yourself for marriage is the right way. Oh. At least that's what he would want. Oh, I didn't know you were married. That's so sweet. Can I see a picture of your husband? I'm not married. Aren't you gonna eat anything? Oh, it's weird. Sometimes I crave food and sometimes I don't get hungry for like six hours. Oh. How far along are you? A few weeks. A few weeks? Let's see. Yeah. Why? Oh, nothing. You're hardly showing. Could never tell. It happened so suddenly. I moved here from Jersey and I didn't know anyone over the summer except for my cousin Gladys. You're Gladys's cousin? Yeah. Oh, I could see yeah. that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's been nice having her. She's been showing me around your neighborhood. Why aren't you sitting with her? Unfortunately, Gladys has mono and has been homesick. Don't you get mono from making out with people? There's no way Gladys is making out with anyone. There's other ways to get it too. Well, anyways, over the summer, I mostly just read a good book and hung out with Gladys. But then somehow the devil put this app on my phone called Tinder. I'm banned from that app. She is. Then one thing led to another, and here I am. Mm. Interesting. So who's the baby daddy? See, can't ask that stuff. Who is he? I prefer not to say. We haven't seen each other since the night of. Why not? <gasps> you had a one night stand. Shh. <laughs> he will hear you, never. These seats aren't the best for someone who's expecting. <laughs> and now I'm hungry all of a sudden. What do you want? I can go get it for you. Oh, that's okay. Are you drinking pickle water? Mm, it's better than plain water. Huh? Can I try it? Of course. What's mine is yours. But all is his at the end of the day. Mmm, it's giving pickle soda. No, really, Rhea, you have to try it. 
I'm good. Maybe next time. It was nice meeting you, Mary. I gotta get going. Do you mind throwing this out for me? Tootsie. Oh, I forgot she's pregnant. I'll meet you at your house after school. We can get ready for Cinnamon's pool party together. Yeah. You have to come with us. Okay, sure. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys later then. Bye. Welcome to the first coolest senior year party hosted by your reigning cheer captain and your future prom queen as well as homecoming queen. Thank you for inviting us to your party, Cinnamon. We weren't invited, Janie. Remember when you're casting your votes, who invited you losers to this party and made you feel cool even if it's just for one night? Yeah, losers, so enjoy. Too bad La Cienega couldn't make it. Oh, what a tragedy. The reason La Cienega is not here today is because I gifted her a mani and pedi at a salon, which accidentally turned out to be four hours away. When she gets there though, the appointment is going to be for the next day. Isn't that hilarious? The last I heard, the maid and her are staying over at some cramped bed and breakfast. And the maid snores. Oh, I wish I was there to see her face. Well, La Cienega missed a great party, and I miss La Cienega. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that and go look for some hot guys to dance with. I refuse to believe only losers showed up. Yeah, so many losers. I wish you were here right now, but even seeing you fills my heart. I wish I was there too. New York is very scary now. You're too cute. Let's go swimming. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you get in my bed? You have to jump. Like this, chicken ball. Maybe. You know I don't do commitment. It slows me down. I know, but it's senior year and I want to finally have a girlfriend. It's so much cooler. Especially when she's as hot as you. All oh, those cats on your dress. Ooh. You might have a taste of these lips, but you'll never own these lips. Oh, come on, babe. You know I can't live without you. Fine. We'll go to homecoming together and then we'll see. Yes! Now kiss me, fool. Party's here! <laughs> But honestly, they're all bothering me so much. Just a problem. Never Uh, I gotta go inside for a sec. Be right back. Take your time, baby. I know I'm too hot to handle. Mm -hmm. Good. Everyone's outside, so no one will see when I go inside and get my YouTube channel back. Then I can really start some drama, drama, drama. Ooh, feels so good to say that again. Oh. Okay. Oh. Get out of my way, candy cane. Strawberry, what are you doing? Be nice. Where has thinking of others ever gotten you? Powerless. Good girl. Uh, 
That is so strong. Now I just have to find a place to hide until this potion works. It's magic. Um, if you see a lot of bubbles, um, I swear it's the hot tub. <laughs> Hi everybody, it's me again. You all seem to be having an amazing time. You all know I throw the best parties. I would like to propose a toast to that. Cheers to that. As well as to my good friend, Raja. Wishing you a speedy recovery since you all care so much. Go give everyone a drink. Rhubarb will be coming around refreshing all of your drinks. Prayers. You, you oh, should no, 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 no. think you are perfect with those flaws. Yeah, you. I, I walked out. Just turn the knob. I can't. You really are an idiot. I'd also like to propose a toast to our new classmate and friend, Mary, who's currently in her pregnant era. Cheers. I want kids to eventually. We should practice. It, no, no. Soon. Whenever we're ready. <laughs> Cheers to that. Uh, are you okay? Yeah. It's probably just morning sickness. I'll be right back. At night. And I'd like to make a toast to Tootsie for making me feel like the most special guy around and for bringing us exceptional music. To Tootsie. Uh, <laughs> to me. <laughs> Lucky guy. Me one. To senior year. The class of 23. The best class ever. You made me miss all the speeches. We forgot one very important toast. A toast to me. The greatest, the kindest, and the hottest person on this planet. Cheers to that. Looks like everyone had their potion. Oh, thank God, it was getting stuffy in here. Reunited at last. <laughs> you are not out here. Why are you hiding? I'm not hiding. I'm just touring the house. It's so, um, big. Are you hiding from us? That depends. Uh, is it mine? <gasps> what kind of question is that? Do you think I just hook up with random people? People who have... No faith. Oh my God, it's mine. It's his first. Everything is his first. We are simply just borrowers. Wait, I'm confused. So am I the father or not? There is only one father, our father. Wait, we're brother and sister? I don't know what I saw in you. The devil must have been working overtime that fateful night. I'm so confused. I'm confused too. Look, you are the father of this child that he decided to put in our faithful path. Look, I can't afford to take care of a kid right now. I can barely afford lunch. You think I want you around my child? Wait, what? 
you're not worthy of raising my child. Only a man who stays pure until marriage is worthy of raising my child. But if you can lend me some money, that would be great. <laughs> like water is an expensive habit to drink as a pregnant woman. For someone who's only a couple weeks pregnant, she's like hella large. I'll do what I can, but money's a little tight right now. Just wait until I'm a football star, and then I'm not interested in all that nonsense and jibber jabber. Look, can we just keep this between the two of us for now? I'd really appreciate that. Of course. I don't want anyone to know I had anything to do with you. Cool, and uh, there's a certain person I don't want knowing about you either. So, uh, that works. <laughs> The only person you should worry about is him. Right. I can't imagine living inside of an attic. I'm gonna go get a drink. Do you want anything? Sure. There should be a jar of pickle water in the fridge. I'll just drink from that. They probably wanted to keep this a secret. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna go lie down now. My feet are killing. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna go get you your pickled water. with my pickle water. <laughs> oh, it looks like chat's passed out. That was a close one and weird too, but I got what I came for and then some. This night's been a great success. any of it. I just woke up on the stairs. I'll tell you what happened. We just had the best party ever. <laughs> How is this the best party ever? I don't even remember anything. Well, duh. Haven't you listened to those songs? It's a sign that you had a good night when you don't remember anything. <sighs> 16 missed calls from me. I have to go. I think we should get going. I want to go home. I'll call us an Uber. Rhea, you can come with us. Thanks, Cameron. Wait, where's Mary? She probably called it an early night and left. Smart girl. Let's go. More drinks! Rhubarb, make sure all the red cups are cleared. I'm going for my bath. Oh, hello. I don't think I've seen you before. I'm Cinnamon, the host of the party, the owner of this home. I know you've made several announcements this evening. Uh, I'm Cam. I actually just live down the street. You do? Then you should stay a while. 
Everyone's clearing out anyways. We're just about to leave, actually. Um, but Tootsie said she forgot her purse somewhere upstairs when she went to the bathroom, so I'm just trying to find it. But it probably wouldn't be on the terrace. Uh, Hold on. Why are you looking for Tootsie's purse? Because she's my girlfriend? <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't think I heard you correctly. Tootsie's your girlfriend? I know. How lucky am I? Oh, you're serious. What I meant to say is, I've known Tootsie my entire life. Great girl. So, are you new in town? What kind of question is that? Of course you are. Because I'm sure I would have noticed you. We just moved up here um, to get closer to Travis Barker's main studio. My dad is actually his manager. No way. My daddy owns a record label. Yeah, Rodriguez Records. My dad's actually mentioned your dad a few times. Oh, we have so much in common. Quick, Cinnamon, think of something before he turns around and leaves. I'm actually going to a show. Backstage, of course. I'm assuming you're going to? Yeah, I, I am. Yeah. We should totally meet up. Be the rich, cool kids with the VIP tickets. What's your number? I don't know about that, if that's a good idea. Oh, come on. I'll totally ask Tootsie to join us. Not wrong. Um, uh, sure. Take my number. Uh, it's 555-4258. Got it. Texted you. Save my number. Cool. Cool. Anyways, I should probably go inside to check for Tootsie's purse, uh, but good to meet you. Uh, I'll text you. I'll be waiting. Have a good night. You're gonna be seeing a lot more of me and a lot less of Tootsie. <sighs> Hi, my name is Mary, and as you can see, I'm expecting, and I know I look a few months, but it's actually only a couple weeks, and now you know who the baby daddy is. Yes, it's Chad, and it was a very unholy summer, but that's okay, because he has other plans for me, and I do whatever he says, and he is currently telling me that you should subscribe and like this video. And I have a question for you. Do we think this is a boy or a girl? Let me know in the comments down below. <sighs> Morning sickness just happens to happen every hour of the day. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. <laughs> Bye.